Hey all brothers and sisters, my name is Captain Meatshield and welcome back to Final Fantasy IX. We're out in the open world. I know that much. But what am I doing? <laughs> uh, we've got to take Garnet, Rogers and Marcus off somewhere. Okay. Remediate- I recognise this tune. Oh god, hi. The carved spider, alright. Yeah, you ain't gonna be doing much, are you? Oh! Oh, I don't like the way it all scrunched up. It's one thing that really freaks me out with spiders is when they die and they just fall on their back and the legs are just gonna go. <laughs> it's not fun. Don't like them. Never have, never will. Uh, <laughs> good god. Everybody wants to come out to play today. Very well. Oh, we got burbs. Hockey dokey. Let's get twatting. That'll do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Ow. My bonk. Okay, my lady, you're gonna have to do some healing. Because these things are taking a while to kill. Right, get on that. What are you draining? Better not be my wallet. He's just thieving health, that's what he's doing. Whoosh, nice. Get it. Nice. <laughs> uh, I gotta say, it is fun coming back into this and hearing that cover after of, or hearing that theme after I'd covered it. That is good fun. <laughs> is this where I'm meant to be going? Trino, yes! I remember now. <laughs> Ooh, the gate. Dark City Trino. Princess, this is Trino, the city of nobles. We need to find out which noble has the super soft. There aren't many nobles living here. The nights are long. It's a great place for thieves. People like you turn this city into a slum. Let's steal the super soft and get this over with. Steal? How dare you? Do you think I'd let you commit a crime before my very eyes? How else would we get the super soft? Quiet. I will allow, not allow such disgraceful behavior. I never ask you to come along. Stop complaining. Don't you talk back to me. First of all... Uh-oh. Do not interrupt me while I'm talking. Look behind you. What? Princess, I urge you not to. But princess? No, not again. <laughs> Never have I dealt with such hardship during my 18 years of service. <laughs> oh, you are living the worst life at the moment, Rogers, ain't you? This is all because of you and your scoundrel friends. Gone. An Alexandrian knight must not let such a frivolous matter get to him. I must find the princess. Yes, I suppose you must. Oh, we've got an active time event. Trino tradition. What is this tradition? Do tell me. Come back here. Was that a pickpocket? I should be careful. Um, hey, my money's gone. The lady lost a thousand gil. Was that that bloody dickhead again? Oh, Arse bag. Alright, there's another one. Um, ambition was the other one that showed up earlier, so we'll go with that. Listen carefully, Mario. This city used to be called the City of Nobles. It's a lie. The nobles pushed us around, right, sis? 
That's right. They hogged all the waterfront property and forced us up into the hills. They exploited us to make their money, right, sis? Right, but we can't just sit here and complain or we'll end up spending the rest of our lives in this miserable place. Power to the people, right, sis? <laughs> That's right, power to the people. Are you going to go and seize the means of production? We'll never go hungry once we become nobles. Oh, no, you just want to become the bourgeoisie. We've had enough of being the proletariat. Follow me, Mario. We're going to go plumbing. What's this world coming to? I honestly don't know, Marcus. There's a shambles, right. I think my lady probably went this way. Confusion. Yes. Because that's just me all over. <laughs> this is not a very nice city. Oh, those cats are having a smooch. Better find Supersoft fast and get back to Alexandria. <coughs> Mistimed that, but okay. <coughs> I got that one. <laughs> He's just hanging out up there and living his best life, I think. At rock bottom. Um, maybe not this way. Yeah, I won't find the super soft over there. Oh. There's an old man. Watch out, he might mug you. Excuse me, have you heard of a thing called super soft? Oh, my wife, she died three years ago. <laughs> no, I'm looking for an item that cures all petrification. Oh, really? I'm doing fine, but thanks for asking. I may be old, but I'm still healthy. Um, thank you very much. You're still young. Don't give up. Good luck. <laughs> Can he join the party? <laughs> uh, oh, hello. What do you want? I have nothing to say to the likes of you. Uh, I guess you don't. It's beautiful. I'll come back with someone else. I don't know what market she's involved in, but stonks. Let's go make him crash like GameStop. <laughs> oh, you! What do you want? Have you seen a beautiful young princess? I mean, a girl around here? Nah, I didn't see any cute girl with long hair. What? What did you say? Nothing. I didn't say anything. I never said I stole any money from her. <laughs> I, I bought a power belt with her money. I'll give it to you. Forgive me. <laughs> Come back here, coward. Well, I got the power belt, so there's that. That's, uh, that was old Wass's face from Alexandria, wouldn't it? It's one of the Scholar clones. Bishop, the master of this mansion, likes to fund scholastic research. He also runs a synthesis shop and rents out a nearby tower to a researcher. Rich people do strange things. Yeah, they certainly do, don't they? Uh, welcome! Cool. We can go about doing some more synthesis stuff. Sadly, I don't have all of the stuff necessary to do any of that. Nor the funds. I suppose at least I got a power belt out of all of this. Uh, uh, oh, um. uh, the main attraction of tonight's auction is a reflect ring, supposedly. Interesting. But if that's true, there's no chance in the world I could ever afford to buy it. You never know. If other people spend money buying other items, it could be cheaper. The man who always sits in the front row is there to buy the main attraction. You can try recommending other items to him, maybe. They're, they're busy being auctioneers and all that stuff. Antiques Roadshow. <laughs> now that's something I haven't thought about in a long time. Ooh, the fact. Are these the pigeons from Observer? Are they chasing me into various other games? Um, hello, I recognize you. You brought Stella Z Stellazio for Queen Stella? Stellazio sounds like some sort of weird alcoholic beverage. It better not be a fake. 
That bird lady can tell right away. Can she? I see. She didn't fall for my cheap imita imitation Stilazio. Well, that's a shame. Okay, she's an actual bird woman. Please bring the Stilazio to the Queen when you find them. The Queen will reward you with a gift when you do. Okay, I'm collecting star-shaped coins called Stilazio. I am only interested in collecting st Stilazio. That's her only hobby. I don't think she does anything else. Does she even eat? Or does she just collect coins? Okay. This place is weird. Trino's shops sell items from all over. It's an excellent place to prepare for a journey. I have to get my usual. Do you mind, sir? You're kind of in the way. Or am I in yours? Oh, bloody no. Active time event. What's going on? Meeting place. Hey there. Is everything okay? What the heck are you talking about? Hey, it's you. Where have you been, Marcus? You know, around. Yeah. The man's waiting for you. Achoo! You're late. A lot happened. I'm kind of tired. No excuses. You're ready to go. You found it? You found the Super Soft? Yep. In a noble's mansion. You'll go by boat and break in tonight. Leave it to me. I'm the one who'll save our bro. Yeah. It's just that you've got two liabilities coming along. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who are the liabilities? I feel very out of place here. I should probably be trying to find the princess. Wherever the fuck she's gone. Oh, right, okay. I'm kind of figuring out where things are now. Unexpected visitor. Oh, she's at the auction. This must be an auction house. Maybe I can find the super soft here. Hmm. Oh, hello. Look whom it might be. What's his face? <laughs> Kuja, that was it. Uh, let's see what this old man's got to say. I used to gamble up a storm at the card stadium when I was young. That was actually... Okay, fair enough. Somewhat coherent. <laughs> Not that I actually had anything to say to him, but whatever. In we go. Oh, princess, thank goodness I found you. I was worried. How can I find the super soft when I keep having to listen to your complaints? Such harsh words. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Go cry about it. I don't think it's here anyway. Where's Marcus? I do not know. Maybe Marcus found it already. Are you coming? I'm going with or without you. I... I shall follow you, Princess. But he's also leading the way. I've seen him before. He's gone. Dun dun dun. Right, we gotta go and find Marcus. In whatever part of town he's in. Zoom to go all the way back to the start and go down the other path. Around this way. And in here. Aha! Found it. Oh, God, can't even get down the stairs. Um, what's this? Wanted! 10,000 gold reward for whoever catches him. Who's him? I need to know these things. We're ready to retrieve the super soft. Good. At last we can save Blank. When do we leave? We can leave right away. So you're coming along, huh? Are you ready? Yep. Let's go. Princess! Please wait! Boss is waiting at the dock. Boss? You mean? Yep. There's only one man we call Boss. 
Let's go and make our introductions. Princess, please wait. It may be a trap. You cannot trust criminals. Think of the consequences. You are a princess. <laughs> if the queen hears about this... Shut up, Rogers. <sighs> princess, do you know that breaking and entering is a crime? I need to make sure you don't steal anything else. Let's go. Damn it. I'm coming along. It is my duty to protect the princess from bad influence. Do whatever you want. Always talking about your duty. Haven't you got any thoughts of your own? Is there nothing in your heart but duty? <laughs> Don't you talk back to me. I'm escorting the princess. I thought you might have changed after traveling with Bumbag. But... You ain't changed. Do you even know why you're here? What do you mean? Let's just go, okay? Let's get on with it. Ooh. Uh, how is Bermesia? Not bad. Better if I didn't have to see those vermin and the ugly elephant lady. They offend my senses. You must be tired. It's not over yet. The rest of the vermin must be done away with. Ooh. It's a good theme. Will you be heading to Clara then? Yes. I trust you will deliver them. Certainly. I shall prepare now. By the way, did you see a pretty lady in the crowd today? A pretty lady? Shall I arrange a meeting? There's no need. The canary I've been after. She flew into my cage of her own free will. Never would I have imagined running into you in a place like this. It must be fate. But you cannot rest your wings yet. Fly home to your mother, my little canary. I, too, will welcome you home with open arms. All right, that's cool and creepy. Why have Final Fantasy villains got to be so damn melodramatic? <laughs> what in the world am I doing? Oh, oh, it's Rogers. <laughs> I am assisting thieves in committing a crime. No, I must be patient. Protect the princess. Escort her back to the castle. Focus on your duties. I trust the Queen. She would never commit a, an atrocity. There must be a good reason. No thoughts of my own? Nonsense. How can I, a lowly knight, understand the Queen's thinking? I need not worry about the ramblings of a criminal. Just think about escorting the Princess home. I'll probably never see him again. He was the culprit. He pulled the Princess and me into his intrigues. It was your fault, bumbag. If you hadn't treated me like a child, I wouldn't be here, hunting after Supersoft to save one of your friends. Why am I doing this? Because Blank saved me? Yes, he saved me. He saved my life. The least I can do is return the favor. But I never thought about things like this before. Or breaking and entering and theft. <laughs> How are we to find Supersoft in this mountain of boxes? Just find it. Someone's coming. Oh, I can't believe I ran out of ink on a night like this. I must find more ink and go back to the observatory. Should I take care of him? Wait. Princess, no. Mm. You're... I've missed you, Dr. Tot. P princess Princess Garnet! Dr. Todd? You know him? Dr. Todd is the highly respected scholar who tutored the princess. Ah, Master Rogers, you must be quiet or you'll wake the shopkeeper. 
But, Princess, what on earth are you doing here? It's a long story. We're looking for Super Soft right now. There is a proper reason for this. We are not here to steal or commit any form of crime. Somebody down there? Run along. I'll give you... Oh, run along. I will give you Super Soft later. Go left from the Trino entrance and continue until you find a large tower. The tower is my home. It's locked, but I shall unlock the door and await your arrival. All right, let's go back. Thank you, Dr. Tot. I'll see you later. Oh, it's you, Dr. Tot. Oh, great timing. I ran out of ink. You should have called me. I'll get yelled at if our inventory's wrong. <laughs> Princess. So this Tootsie's gonna give us super soft. It's hot. Achoo! <laughs> Whatever. I can't believe Tantalus is at the mercy of some old man. Hmm. I guess we gotta keep babysitting the princess. Still, he ain't gonna give you the super soft unless you're with the princess. That's the deal, princess. I'm asking you to take Marcus to this t Marcus to this toot. Tot. <laughs> I was going to anyway. Well, get some rest before you go. I'm sure Ted needs some time to prepare. <laughs> I like Baku and his complete disregard for other people. <laughs> right, I need to go and get some rest, presumably. I also need to go and find that tower, but down here there's a chest. So, we're going to go and see what's in it. Don't mind me, madam, I'm just thieving your stuff. I didn't come here to thieve, but that's what I'm doing. One gill? My theft just wasn't worth it. What do you sell? Wide selection. Okay. You call that a wide selection? My ass is wider than that. Jesus. So, should I just try and find... Alright, Trino entrance left. Is this... Ooh. It's ten gil thrown in the water. I'm gonna throw in ten gil. I feel happier. Oh. If only it was that easy in real life. Wait. This way? This looks like it could be it. I saw him. I saw an old man wearing glasses walking out of this tower. Yeah, this is it. This is big. Oh, it's a fucking tower. Of course it is. Towers are normally big. Ooh, mithril dagger. Hey, I'm in. Oh. Oh. Oop. Dr. Tot. Well, he did say he'd unlock the door, so it's unsurprising that he's here. Princess, thank you for coming. Welcome to my humble abode. This is your home? I traveled quite far in search of a sponsor for my research after I departed Alexandria. I finally found one here in Trino. You have grown into a fine young woman. I am pleased to see you again. Dr. Tart, you look like look quite well. Ah, Master Rogers, you are escorting the princess? Yes, sir. I deeply regret my actions earlier. Still a straight arrow, aren't you? I'm sure you had your reasons, but I won't ask why. The Super Soft is in the box right there. Please take it. Don't mind if I do. Hey, have you no manners? Thank the good doctor. It's quite all right, Master Rogers. Master Tot, is this Gaia? Yes, it's a globe of our planet Gaia. I remember your lessons. You remember the ramblings of an old fool. Two phrases are commonly found in documents more than 500 years old. One is duel. The other is summon a tribe. But 500 years ago, the phrases mysteriously vanished from history. Then how do you know about them? Hmm. The archaeologist Frederick Ash theorized that Jewel refers to the pendant passed down to the ruler of Alexandria. But the pendant is much too small to be referring to the same Jewel. 
Other research suggests a relationship between Eidolons and magical stones. Dr. Tart. Oh, she's so small. Ah, oh, princess. Were you reading big books again? <laughs> I've already read every book in this library. But I think better when I'm surrounded by old books. Really? I don't like books. You are a person of dignity. It is imperative that you study hard. I know, I know. Oh, but I was quite taken by that book you gave me. What was it called? It was... Was it I Want to Be Your Canary by Lord Avon? Oh yes, that's the one. So there is a book I like after all. My, my. What's this, Dr. Tut? That is a globe of Gaia. It is a model of our planet. A Gaia globe? I never knew our castle was shaped like a sphere. Oh, <laughs> we live on the surface, Princess. Ah yes, the stars. Inspire the theories relating stones and Eidolons. That is why... Oh, I'm sorry, I was lost in thought again. It's okay. Where is my room on this globe? Oh, your room is much too small to point out on this globe. What about the castle? That I can do. Oh. How long has it been? Eight years? Time passes quickly. But I haven't changed. I continue to collect and research these items. Where did you find this globe? It's an antique. It's broken, as you can see, but I use it as, as an observation deck. Ironic, isn't it? Looking up at the sky from inside a globe? It sure is. Princess, I don't mean to meddle in your affairs, but... I'm on your side, now and forever. Please tell me if there's anything I can do. Dr. Todd. I see. So the Queen's forces have already grown quite powerful. Okay then. It may be dangerous, but I shall see to it that you reach Alexandria. How? I had an old transportation device remodeled in the case of such an emergency. This way, please. <laughs> I just love the way that just went bush and opened. <laughs> ah, we can finally return to Alexandria. I'm coming with you. What? Why? I can reach Blank more easily from Alexandria. Yes, come with us, Marcus. Okay, Rogers? Uh, let's go save Blank and restore my mother to her former self. Well, let's do that. Hop, hop. Please be equipped for battle. There are monsters underground. Please take the ladder inside to hold down when you are ready. Right, will do. Uh, whoop. Down we go. Gargan Roo. Okay. This is Gargan Roo, an ancient travel route between Trino and Alex Alexandria. Why was this thing built under a tower? Actually, Gargan Roo was in use long before the even the invention of airships. The tower was built on top of the disused tunnel. But it looks fairly new. I convinced the Mr. Bishop to keep this place intact. I haven't used it since it was remodeled, mind you. We must first activate the tunnel connection sequence and call the Gargant inside. Let's see. Where was the sequence trigger? So all we have to do is find the sequence trigger. Princess, let us find it. Okay. This is going to be funky. As funky as it looks, I think I'm going to save this for the next episode. Uh, it's been really nice to kind of dive back into this and try and find all the characters' voices again. And I'm just really eager to get back into things. So here's to continuing the adventure. Oh, it's nice to be back. But I will wrap this episode up here, so I'm just going to say thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, check out the playlist on the channel for more Let's Plays and Metal Covers, and give this video a like or a comment just to leave your thoughts. And if you wish to join the ever-growing ranks of the Order of the Shield, do subscribe to the channel, or maybe consider checking out my Patreon and becoming an officer within the ranks. But thank you again for watching this video, I'll catch you all very, very soon. This is Captain Meat Shield, signing off.
Well, I mean, he's leaving, so it's all right, but... Why? They're all leaving. Somebody called a meeting or something. 